Coast Symposium on Addictive Disorders is taking place this weekend at the La Quinta Resort. The event began Thursday and runs through tomorrow afternoon. KMIR's Corbin Baker was there today and has this story. The fifth annual West Coast Symposium on Addictive Disorders is a huge four-day international event right here in the Valley with over 800 participants from 38 states and four different countries. You know, this is one of the leading conferences in the country. It really brings together um, a wide variety of uh, the top treatment uh, centers uh, nationally. One of the things that the C4 conferences are known for is um, a great energy. We try and have them at uh, very nice places that, that do great things for us to uh, be a host to the field, to kind of give them a feeling of of being taken care of. The West Coast Substance Abuse Disorder Symposium is an event that combines workshops and seminars on timely industry topics. One such topic is the correlation between substance abuse and returning military veterans. Well, one of the things that we really know is that there's a pretty clear relationship between addiction and post-traumatic stress disorder. So uh, I know that the VA is developing programs in virtually all of their hospitals to address both of those issues. Um, there's a very large trend at this point to begin to integrate um, addiction and trauma counseling together. Um, it maximizes the opportunity that clients will actually be able to stay in recovery if they're working on that traumatic process simultaneously. In the old days we used to think you had to separate the two treatments and now we're beginning to realize that if you, if you don't treat them together you really miss the opportunity and relapse is a much more likely uh, scenario. Dr. Barnes says that there are new innovations in not just treating all different kinds of addiction, but sustaining a lasting recovery. Even though we've known for years that addiction is a chronic illness, we've always treated it as an acute illness with these relatively short, very specific time frames. And we're really beginning to look at what we call recovery management, the idea that um, if a, a disease is a chronic illness that someone will have for a lifetime, that recovery needs to be a process that's actively uh, engaged in for a lifetime. With over 50 workshops, 60 faculty members, and 105 exhibitors, there is something for everyone in attendance and a positive energy is promoted throughout the conference. We have a lot of different people here that do many different things within the industry, so we try to provide a few for, uh, for each person. It's a labor of love for a lot of folks, and so it's it's good to have people get together and share the love amongst themselves. Now again, the WCSAD is an annual event and is partnered with the La Quinta Resort to be held at the end of May for the next 15 years. From the newsroom, I'm Corbin Baker, KMIR News. Officers arrested.